Hey everyone, happy Tuesday. How are you today? Um, it's Tuesday, new bundle comes out, came out yesterday. Um, welcome to So Fancy, by the way. If you're new, say hello, say let me know when you're on. Let me know how remote learning is going today, if you are remote learning at your house. Um, my kids are on break, they're outside with my husband playing, which is good, because you know, we're having fun. Which brings me to our new bundle, the Fun Font Fun Fun Craft Font Bundle. Fun Craft Font Bundle came out yesterday. It is nineteen ninety nine and has twelve fonts included in the bundle. And some of the fonts are a dual font. Some of them have like three different versions: an outline version, a chunky version, a version with little stars which we're going to use today we're going to use two of them today um but the fun craft font bundle 19.99 came out yesterday which means that we have a coupon going on which i put the code up top don't do it now wait till we're done it expires tomorrow wednesday april first i believe the 22nd wednesday at 11 59 p.m eastern standard time West Coast folks, get it today. Then you don't even have to worry about it. But last night I was trying to think of what do we use fonts for? Fonts have so many different ways to be used. You can use them in cards. You can use them for signs. You can use them in shirts. HTV, adhesive vinyls. Uh, the script fonts are great for invitations if you're doing those. Business cards, if you're making up you know, printing out your own little business cards, magnets. So many different things our fonts fonts can be used for. Hey, Donna, um, what do you guys like to use them for? I would, I love hearing what, what everybody uses them for because I stockpile fonts. If I see fonts on sale, if I see a bundle, get them because you never know when you need to write something, add something to a design, you want to put a name you've got we've got great bundles like the must have summer bundle i meant to pull this up there are some wicked cute little fruit pieces in it which would be so cute on a onesie if you put like sweet or a baby's name with a watermelon slice something like that but when you don't have a lot of fonts you have little choices so this bundle has 12 fonts and it's 19.99 15% off with the coupon through tomorrow. But I thought, I haven't tried these before, and I thought today would be a great day to do this together, right? Because we love it when things work. But I have a bunch of these wood slices that I bought off of Amazon, and I did put a link up for some. They're just blank wood slices. They're, they're called unfinished wood plaques. And they're thin. You can suck. And we, Melissa's done um, the printable heat transfer vinyl on these just to make little signs. But I've got a few of them. And I thought, well, I've seen the hot mess canvases where you take a canvas and you paint it. And then you take a vinyl, you take adhesive and you cut out your, your saying or your design. You lay it over and then you paint it all white and then you pull off your wording so I thought I'm gonna paint a sign isn't that pretty all different kinds of paint there's some glitter ones in there you just make a hot mess because aren't we all but I was thinking about it this is a great project for kids and right now they need to have art with remote learning Mother's Day is coming Father's Day is coming something just fun for them they could just paint this together you could cut out your design if you've got scrap adhesive which is what this is and this i just started pre-weeding i'm going to show you how this is like here i had one little letter from something i did last week where i just needed one letter so i have this big scrap so why not use it um so what we're going to do is we're going to weed and i used the one of the fonts it's called sweet duck I think and there's three 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 different versions of the font 
there's an outline of it. There is just a chunky, I love chunky fonts, kind of like just girth to them. And then there's a, the chunky with stars, the chunky and a word with the stars. <laughs> Excuse me. Monogram bundle, still here. Go check that one out. Hi, Michelle. So I'm going to pull you down. We're going to finish weeding this. And I'm going to show you. And it's just a great way to use fonts. Again, you can use fonts foil quilling. There's some beautiful script fonts in this bundle. That would be just great with foil quilling. Um, another option for it. So many. But I'm going to pull you down. You can see my paint. Some sublimation. Um parchment paper to paint on, which we're going to use when we go to finish painting. But when you do these hot mess, which I have not done one yet, again, first time for everything, we pull this apart and weed just like um, a decal. So we don't want to do the negative like you would do with um, a stencil. We're going to do it just normal, just like a decal. I'm going to put that back on. I already started this, as I said, just to get a jump start on it so that um, we're not doing too many. And these are just little stars. You can even... Um, Pull these off and put them around if you wanted but I'm not gonna go that far I always like to reuse a lot if you're using HTV for this these little stars would be amazing to replace um, use in the design there's only three stars I think per letter I'm just trying to see where they are um, so you take your, your I love this one. This will be one of my favorites from now on. So we're going to get crafty. I know it's backwards, but we're going to pull this down. We're going to take some transfer tape. I kind of have a bigger piece than I need. Um, but we're just going to take this over. I'm going to do it this way. I'm going to get a scraper here somewhere. I'm going to burnish it. And even this in itself would be a wicked cute decal. Or to put on a shirt. Or just about anything. Chalkboard. Um, pull from the side. There we go. Okay. We're going to put this onto our little hot mess. Now, I know you can't really see it with the colors I use. You could just do this and, um, ah, I just pulled it over my transfer tape with a decal or with a piece of, and make this like a decal, but we're going to do it like a stencil. So you want to make sure that it is all stuck and just go slow with your tape. Sometimes with wood. It doesn't stick as well as we would like, but it takes a little bit of elbow grease and a little bit of pushing. Not bad at all. And we're just going to put this on. So again, how are you guys all handling things? Oh, I forgot my 
think I, oh no, I don't. Somewhere I forgot a little uh, star in my weeding. I have to go back and make sure I got all of those out. Um, how's everybody faring? You got some masks going. Everybody wearing masks, making masks. Hopefully going around. You know, we've got some great um, files for masks. If you've not checked those out, check out our freebies. Okay. So, I just want to make sure that I have all of my little stars out of my design. And I do. I'm going to push this down. Now, mm -hmm. here's where our hot mess comes in. And again, great for kids if you have not done this. We're going to take white paint. White. I'm going to just put it here in the corner. And what you do, hopefully I have enough. Oh boy. We're going to cover this. And go over your letters. I'm doing this straight on here. And usually you'll want to do a couple of layers to make sure that you cover up your paint that you put on. You don't want to press down with your brush over the letters too hard because um, you don't want like when we do stenciling, you just kind of stipple around it. So we're going to do this. We're going to get it covered. We're going to add some more paint on it. Like so. If anybody has any tips on this, I'm welcoming them as I've not done this before, as I said. But then you let it dry. But again, fun project for kids, I think. Um, to have them painting along. Fun part is, it's a fun, messy kind of project. Don't have to be too um, neat with it. Doesn't have to be perfect at this point. And it just has to be covered, which I think is pretty good. I'm sure, I'm sure on a canvas too, it's going to be different. But we're going to leave this just for one second. And just like with the stencil, I like to peel wet. I'm going to close up my paint. I don't want that drying out. And this is where it's going to get a little bit messy. Hot mess, right? I'm going to pick up my letters. Should have had some paper towels in here too. I think I have a couple. What happens is the letters that we put down come up. Just like so. Easy, right? Look how pretty that one is. But this is fun for kids. These would be great for grandparents' gifts for Mother's Day, Father's Day, teacher gifts if, when we go back to school. There. Easy, right? A couple seconds. Good. Okay, it is still wet, but pretty, right? Stars, stars came out good. Fun. <laughs> hot mess. We're all a hot mess. I'm going to flip you back up here without trying to get paint on anything. I have some comments. Let's see. Oh, good. You've been making masks and cutting. That's awesome. We need them. Everybody needs them. 
Oh, lay it on my heat press to heat to dry it quicker. Yes, that would have been good if I had that on. So if you're doing a hot mess um, canvas, turn on your heat press. But all I did was I just painted squares and then put my design down and painted it all white. When it dries, I will get a picture out for you guys. Uh, I'm sure we'll have them up. But if you've got your paint sitting around, I don't think we can do this on paper because your adhesive will stick to the paper. Um, but canvas will work. Fidget these wood slices. Again, I did put a link up there for the slices. And this is just using fonts from our Fun Craft Font Bundle. It's got 12 different fonts in there, which you can use. There's chunky ones, there's thin ones. You can make up any saying. That's the fun part of being able to use fonts is possibilities are endless. So go check it out. Get your wood slices. Get your kids involved if you can. If not, make some beautiful signs. Decorate. Fun time to redecorate everything. Get crafty. Okay, you guys have a great day. We will see you soon. I just got paint all over it. I got to turn this off. Um, we'll see you soon. Take care. Go check out the link in the new bundle. Hurry because 15% off will end tomorrow night. And then it's full price, which is $19.99 for the bundle. Um, but get it for 15% off while you can. You guys have a great day and we'll see you soon. Bye.